Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're planning to take your FE exam this year and are considering to purchase an FE course to help you prepare, then you might be wondering which one to choose. Well, in this video, I'll share a few things to consider when deciding which FE course is right for you. Oh yeah, everybody now. Investing in a course can really help you accelerate your journey, prepare for the FE more efficiently and increase your chances of passing the FE exam. A good course will help you feel less stress, be more productive and learn more. However, not all courses are created equal. I have seen many students who spent a lot of money on a course that didn't help them pass their FE and that can be very demoralizing. Sometimes it's not the student's fault and they just picked a course that wasn't a good fit for them. So I hope this video helps you find a course that will help you pass your FE. Here are a few things to consider when choosing an FE course. The first thing we have is access. How much access will you have to the course? Some courses offer four months, some offer six months and others offer one year. Some even offer unlimited lifetime access. It's important to consider access when choosing an FE course because you want to be able to review the study material as much as possible. When it comes to preparing for the FE, reviewing the subjects is going to help you reinforce the concepts and retain it for your FE. Also, if you only have access to the study material for a short period of time, you'll be constantly feeling stress instead of focusing on learning the material. Having more time, it will allow you to study without feeling rushed. Another thing is sometimes life happens and you may need to take a break from studying. And when you have access to the course for a longer period of time, you can always pause your studying and you can pick up where you left off when you're ready to study again. Also, if you fail the FE, you want to be able to access the course again to review and reinforce the concepts. Because guys, you have to remember that there are three phases of learning in the FE. The first phase is getting familiar with the material. The second phase is understanding the concepts and knowing how to solve the problems. And the third phase is retaining and remembering the information. Sometimes we rush to our studies and we don't fully review and retain the material. So having access to the course again without paying any more money can be very helpful. And when you start preparing for your PE exam, you can always go back and review the material since many of the FE subjects will be on the PE exam as well. The second thing to consider when choosing an FE course is the instructor. Do you remember the college classes where you did well? Well, one of the reasons you probably did well and enjoyed those classes was because of the professor. A lot of times when we have good professors, we feel motivated and we do well overall. On the other hand, if the professor's teaching style does not resonate with us, we might not do as well. Same thing applies for the FE. So it's important to know who your instructor will be and do some research to see if you like them. Also, don't spend a lot of money on a course only to find out that you don't fully understand the instructor. Some instructors have free YouTube problems. You can check those out just to get a sense of their teaching style. Some courses also offer refunds within the first couple of days of purchase. So you can get those courses and then watch some lectures just to see if you like the instructor. Moving on to the third point, teaching style. When evaluating the instructor, make sure they don't skip any steps when solving problems. They don't assume students remember concepts from college. They start from the basics and they break down and simplify concepts and problems so they're easy to understand. By the way, guys, if you find any of these tips helpful, please don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps the channel out immensely. All right, point number four, course structure. You should also look at how the course is designed and what study material you will get. Long lectures are not the most efficient way to study for the FE exam. It's hard to stay focused for hours, especially after a long day of work. Additionally, you may not grasp as many concepts. See, the best way to learn engineering is by solving problems and seeing how the engineering concepts are being applied. When I was in college and preparing for the FE exam, I did a lot of problems to make sure I understood the concepts. And having someone walk you through all the steps for each problem is also important because this way you won't miss any steps, you'll have a deeper understanding of the problems and you'll be better prepared to tackle most FE problems. 
Now, the course should have bite-sized videos that are easy to understand and process so that you can retain the information for your FE. Next, we have is updated. The FE exam is constantly changing. For example, the NCS just added new table and equations under transportation and surveying. So make sure the course you choose is updated to match the latest version of the exam. Number six, personalized support. It's very important to have support when preparing for the FE. The journey can be overwhelming and having someone to help you can make a big difference. So make sure you'll be able to get help if you have any questions. And the last thing we have backgrounds. Has the course helped students from various backgrounds pass? It's important to see which students are passing their FE and compare their situations to yours. For example, if a course has only helped recent graduates pass, then it might not be as helpful for someone who has been out of school for a while. On the other hand, if a course has helped both recent graduates and those who've been out of school for a while, then it's likely a good fit for anyone. Let me know what you guys think of this list. Would you add anything? Comment below what you look for in an FE course or any course in general. And if you are looking for study material under $1,000, make sure to check out this video here. In your search for the right study material, make sure to check out our courses. All our courses come with unlimited lifetime access. I teach all the lectures and problems myself, and you can check out some of our YouTube videos to see if my teaching style resonates with your learning style. I also try to simplify and break down problems so they're easy to understand. And our courses are regularly updated. In fact, we just added new videos on conic sections, level of service, and mass hall diagram. We also have a dedicated team that answers students' questions on our FE problems, study tips, and motivation. We also hold weekly meetings every Saturday where I solve engineering problems, check on students' progress, and share the best study tips for the FE. We do everything we can to help our students pass the FE exam. Now, if you want to learn more about our courses, go ahead and check out this video here. Now, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great week, and I will see you on the next video. À la prochaine! Oh yeah,